Hey, what's going on, YouTube? It's Dan Harkins, and as always, thanks for tuning in to another gameplay of Team Deathmatch. I'll be doing some sniping, I'll be shooting people with the AE4 laser gun, and overall, probably beating people's faces in and feeling really good about it. But that's not what I want to talk about. Obviously, I want to talk about what I'd like to see in the next installment of Call of Duty. What should make a comeback? What shouldn't? So let's start off with number one, theater mode. Bring that shit back. I miss it. I love being able to see who killed me, how they outplayed me. Like making little montage clips, cutting them up, doing the dolly system. That's really cool and I really enjoyed that aspect of, of Black Ops 2. And then it just disappeared. Now, some people say, hey, theater mode caused a lot of lag, caused a lot of problems. I really didn't notice it. Now, it's not to say, hey, it probably did, but I, I never was on the, the end where shit wasn't going well. And I definitely want to see that make a comeback. Uh, the next thing I'd like to see, I, I don't know if I want to see exosuits come back. I kind of on the fence on it. I like the exo abilities, but until they can get the maps designed better for this, I just don't know if I want to see people jumping and, and flying around. I mean, come on. We have Halo for that if you want to jump around. There's tons of different arena shooters, and it kind of takes away from Call of Duty's thing, you know, running and gunning. It's, and it's very difficult when you have six people all over the place. Like, you cannot account for where the hell someone's going to be. And that's why it's so difficult in this game to, you know, get kill streaks to bring those back. It's just, it fucking sucks. So, let's hope that uh, they find a way to either impl to implement it correctly or just do away with it. Either way, I, I don't know where I kind of sit on that. Maybe I just don't want to see them come back. I like using them. Maybe have a special mode. Fuck if I know. Next thing I'd like to see is revenge spawns. Get that shit the fuck out of this game. We don't need that anymore. People shouldn't be getting killed from someone they just killed and then the game puts them in a corner behind the person that just killed them. They, they, they it's, it's not fair. Now, some people say, you know what? People shouldn't be able to go on good streaks like that. They should not be fucking destroying everybody. And this is what I say to you guys. Stop getting fucking killed and use your goddamn brain. Most of these people getting murdered are just playing like shit. And it's not to say that it doesn't happen to me. I play like shit, but I take it unless I die about 15 times in a row. Then I'm probably going to leave the game because I'm losing my shit and I ain't going to play like that. Next thing I'd like to see is possibly classes that can have their own cor uh, score streaks again. I don't know why they did away with it, but I like having the ability of having a class geared with score streaks for a certain way like in, in black ops 2 i'd like to have you know the counter uav uav vsat uh, but in Modern Warfare 3 you could have different score streaks based on a class and i would like to see that i would like to see that uh make a return the next thing i'd like to see i don't want to see quick draw and stock make another appearance and i know some people are going to be like why blah 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 I just, I feel personally, it just ruins the balance of weapons. A submachine gun shouldn't be destroying someone in assault rifle range. And and vice versa, assault rifle shouldn't be make, rounding a corner and destroying someone that has a submachine gun. I feel it fucks up a lot of shit and it should go away. You can hate on me if you want. I don't fucking like it. it needs to go away. It's ridiculous. Guns need to have their specific roles. You have a shotgun, close range, sniper rifle, long range. Salt rifle, you got that long to medium range. You have that submachine gun, you do really good in close quarter combat. You can do okay at medium range, but you shouldn't be taking out people long range like it's nothing all the time. Now, yeah, if you take the time to be accurate and someone lets you kill them, yeah, you fucking earn it. But it's the one thing that I just, I don't want to see that shit come back into Call of Duty. And I know in my heart, it's going to come back, and it sucks, but I really would like to see it not come back. Next thing, let's have some really fun kill streaks that are worth getting, or score streaks. I don't want to go back on a kill streak system, 
but it feels like black ops 2 had the best feeling for the kill streaks and i would actually say modern warfare 3 had it pretty decently as well but it just feels like in ghosts and this they're just kind of underwhelming there's really nothing really cool about it now I like that you can improve your score streak uh, by you know little modules and that should make a comeback as well as weapon variants that can be obtained via challenges the variants and getting all these type of clothes it's kind of it's, it's actually pretty cool uh, it's just kind of frustrating with all the randomness and some of these really good guns you're just waiting you know hey when am I gonna get this gun is this supply drop gonna gonna have it oh shit no it's some knee pads or Nigerian pants or a Nigerian helmet or Nigerian gloves it's gonna be Nigerian something or a sentinel medic come on we need to have a specific way to get weapons and I know they're looking at a way to implement that in the future in advanced warfare but if Treyarch wants to bring this back that'd be super um I have some more but I'll do that in another video because my time is done thanks for watching